Over here, go ahead. The next administration will be the one ultimately that implements a lot of the distribution of this vaccine and will oversee much of the future of the way Operation Warp Speed goes forward. Why not include members of the Biden transition team as part of this summit that you're hosting today? Well, we're going to have to see who the next administration is because uh, we won in those swing states and uh, there was uh, terrible things that went on. So we're going to have to see who the next administration is. But whichever the next administration is will really benefit by what we've been able to do with this incredible science, uh, the doctors, all of the people that came up, the lab technicians, the, wor the work that's been done is incredible. And it will be incredible for the next administration. And hopefully the next administration will be the Trump administration because you can't steal hundreds of thousands of votes. You can't have fraud and deception and all of the things that they did and then slightly win a swing state. And you just have to look at the numbers, look at what's been on tape, look at all the corruption, and we'll see. You can't win an election like that. So hopefully the next administration uh, will be the Trump administration, a continuation, which has led us to the highest stock markets we've ever had, the best employment numbers we've ever had, a rebuilt military. Uh, if you look at uh, the tax reductions are the greatest in history, the regulation reductions the greatest in history, it leads us to Space Force, which nobody thought was possible. All of the things we've done, and we were rewarded with a victory. Now let's see whether or not somebody has the courage, whether it's a legislator or legislatures, or whether it's a justice of the Supreme Court or a number of justices of the Supreme Court. Let's see if they have the courage to do what everybody in this country knows is right. I received almost 75 million votes, the highest number of votes in the history of our country for a sitting president. 12 million more than the 63 million we received four years ago. President Obama received 3 million less in his second term, and he won easily. I received 12 million more, which, by the way, is a record. 12 million more. And they say that when the numbers came out, and the numbers came through machines, and all of those ballots were taken away and added, all you have to do is turn on your local television set, and you'll see what happened with thousands of ballots coming out from under tables, with all of the terrible things you saw, all you have to do is take a look. And if somebody has the courage, I know who the next administration will be. And I'll tell you what, life will be much easier for this country because of what we've done right now. And because of a lot of the people in this room, the job you've done on the vaccine, together with a lot of others, has been a modern day miracle. And it's really been acknowledged as such. And I want to thank you. I want to give you my love. And I want to give you my thanks because you're very special people. And now, good luck. You distribute that general and really set records, okay? Set records just like we've been doing for four years. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.